film music, especially Lataji's music, was the real culture of our country. Everyone has grown up listening to her uh, songs, and, and she could sing in anybody's uh, in any you know she would fit a girl at the uh, twelve uh, uh, or a person at eighty. So she was a blessed soul, and I think it, the most amazing part today, what I'm seeing on television, is that uh, our country's uh, uh, prime minister ji. Uh, has gone and paid his tribute. I mean, that for a musician is a very big thing. And and today the whole nation, I think, uh, uh, there'll be nobody like her. There was never anyone like her, uh, and there can never be anyone like her. I think uh, we lost a very big jewel today, and India lost one of its big. Uh, what what do you say? The Kohinoor of our country. And uh, Aman Ali Bangash, uh, as a musician. What are the lessons, perhaps, that you have taken away that others uh, uh, who are in this field can take away when you hear about her dedication, her discipline? Uh, what what can you take away from her legacy? Firstly, honestly, uh, Zara, I feel she was a self-made person. Uh, she did everything on her own. She kept the whole family together. And the biggest thing what I've learned from her, of a person of that stature, was humility. She was a very humble person, a very caring, loving person. She never saw who's who and spoke to the person. She spoke to everybody, a very fun-loving person, a very educated person. She knew everything as about sports, about movies. So for musicians like us, like uh, beginners like us, we feel that, wow, a person like this can be such a humble person. There's so much to learn from her. I mean, there's so much to learn. And there's so much of music that she's left behind. I mean, most of the songs are so difficult that she's sung. I mean, as a musician, I can never produce those songs. But as I said, I have not seen Maa Saraswati. But if there was a Maa Saraswati, it would have been Lata Ji, for sure.